in the world of prehistoric animals, few are as fascinating and awe-inspiring as the short-faced bear. This massive carnivore roamed North America during the Pleistocene epoch and was one of the largest predators of its time. In this video, we'll delve into the origins, lifestyle, and current status of the short-faced bear. Subscribe to our channel for more informative contents. The short-faced bear, or Arctatus simus, is believed to have first appeared in North America around 1.8 million years ago. It is thought to have evolved from an earlier species of bear, and over time, it grew to become one of the largest land predators in history. As its name suggests, the short-faced bear had a distinctive flattened face and a relatively short snout. Its skull was also unusually broad and robust, which gave it the ability to deliver powerful bites. Despite its fearsome appearance, however, the short-faced bear was an omnivore, and its diet likely consisted of both meat and plants. The short-faced bear was an apex predator, meaning that it had no natural predators of its own. It was also incredibly fast and agile, and could run at speeds of up to 40 miles per hour. This made it a formidable hunter, and it was able to take down large prey such as bison, mammoths, and even other predators. Sadly, the short-faced bear went extinct at the end of the Pleistocene epoch, around 11,000 years ago. There is still some debate among scientists about the exact cause of its extinction, but it is believed to have been due to a combination of factors, including climate change and human hunting. Despite its extinction, the short-faced bear remains an important part of the natural history of North America. Its massive size and fearsome reputation have captured the imaginations of people for centuries, and it continues to fascinate scientists and enthusiasts alike. In conclusion, the short-faced bear was a remarkable creature that played an important role in the ecosystems of North America during the Pleistocene epoch. While it is no longer with us, its legacy lives on, and we can continue to learn from this fascinating creature for years to come. Thanks for watching.